Hello friends! It's me, Smarty the Alpaca. Today I found something green on a branch with tiny white berries. It looks pretty, but what is it? It's called mistletoe. Let me tell you all about it. If you like my adventures, tap subscribe and give this video a little like. It helps me make more fun stories for you. First, what is mistletoe? Mistletoe is a plant that often grows on trees, not in the ground. Imagine a little house growing on a branch. Mistletoe makes its own food from sunlight, just like other green plants, but it also takes some water from the tree it lives on. Scientists call that being a hemiparasite, which is a big word that simply means it borrows a little water from its tree neighbor. How does mistletoe spread and grow? Here's the fun part. Birds help spread it. Mistletoe makes juicy white berries that birds love to eat. When a bird eats a berry, a tiny seed can stick to the bird's beak or come out later. The bird then flies to another tree and the seed can get rubbed onto a new branch. If the seed stays there, it can grow into a new mistletoe plant. So birds are like little gardeners, nature's helpers. Now an important safety rule. Those white berries look tasty but they are poisonous. People and pets can get very sick if they eat them. So never taste or eat mistletoe berries, and tell an adult if you find any. If you touch the berries, let an adult know and wash your hands. Safety first! People have noticed mistletoe for a very long time. Because mistletoe often stays green during winter when many trees lose their leaves. People thought it was special, a sign of life and hope in the cold. Long ago, in old stories and traditions, mistletoe was seen as something magical or lucky. Over many years, people began hanging sprigs of mistletoe during winter celebrations. That's how the custom started. Hanging mistletoe in a doorway became a friendly tradition. Later, people began the practice of giving a quick kiss or a hug under the mistletoe as a sign of friendship or love. But remember, that is just a custom. Always ask first. If someone doesn't want a hug or a kiss, a smile, wave, or high five is just as kind. Are there different kinds of mistletoe? Yes. There are many kinds around the world. Some have white berries, others red. Some grow on oaks, others on apple trees or poplars. Even though they look a little different, many mistletoes share the same special habits. They grow on branches and rely on birds to move their seeds. Want a safe, fun idea? Make a paper mistletoe craft. Cut out green leaves and white circles for berries, glue them together, and hang the paper mistletoe on a door. It looks lovely and it's safe because there are no real berries to eat. Here's a little jingle to remember the main points. Sing it once or twice. Mistletoe, mistletoe, green and bright, hanging quietly through the night. Birds bring seeds that travel far, kindness under you, that's what we are. To sum it up, mistletoe is a plant that grows on trees. Birds help spread its seeds. People long ago thought it was special because it stayed green in winter, and now it's a symbol of friendship and love during the holidays. But the most important part is safety. Do not eat the berries, tell an adult if you find mistletoe, and always ask before hugging or kissing under it. Thanks for learning about mistletoe with me today. If you liked this, don't forget to subscribe and hit like, it really makes Smarty smile. See you next time.